Right. There we go. And they all turned off a little bit late to help. Right. So that's a dead end. Some bags of iron ore. A chest with four orans in it. So valuable. And then I think this is going to be the interesting bit, is if I can get through here. So that requires a key. So now I've got two places to look for keys in. I can still hear noises, so I'm guessing down the other passageway to the left. There's going to be a few more monsters. I can see it. No, it's not going to let me light the thing because the monster was too close. There we go. Right, there's the light. Was who's got? A, someone's got a torch. Nice. Blast the greater rock fiend. The people have stood in the way. And now they're going to get exploded. So I'm guessing down here is where the nest is. Because there's been a lot of them down here. Uh, ooh, red meteorite sword. What's that? That was all. Okay. Um, well, I guess the third passageway is going to have all of the good stuff in it then. Because if not, then I've missed something. Which is a possibility. So I hope that I wouldn't have missed uh, something. Ha. Huh. I thought there was something hiding. Ah. Ow. Right. They are still hiding around the corner. There we go. And my adrenaline is fully charged. Right. Ooh. A mutagen. Perfect. Aha. And there is... A body, which I'm going to guess has the keys in it. There we go. Upper shaft key, Balan's first map, and Balan's journal. Right. Let's take all of that. So, upper shaft. Where's it going to be? Books. Can I read the book? There we go. So the book is going as planned. It seems our yield will be even greater than we anticipated. More of our belief being squeezed much more from this mine. We'll delve deeper, bring it more wealth, and Vogan will regain its past significance. Okay. And that's what we can see from the mini-map. So, there's a key for the upper shaft, which I'm going to guess is the first bit we went to. Because that was down. So I think we'll go check there first. Yeah, there's still only two places that actually need a key that I can remember. So we'll check here first, then we'll check the other place if the key doesn't work. Aha. But it did. I can hear monsters. Ooh. There we go. Take out the big one instantly. Ooh. It's done the slow time thing. Which isn't very useful seeing as we're out of combat. 
but it's a cool effect. Right. So there's another little thing on the left there. And back away. Right. Is there another one? There is another one over there. I want to light this light first. Right. Oh, there's two here. There we go. Synchronized explosions. Um, anything useful here? A club, iron ore, and I'm carrying too much. Uh, oh, boy, wait. Let's drop half of them. There we go. That's freed up plenty of space. Anything else? Another door. And another split in the path by the look of the map. Ah. Oh, so that joins up with where we were earlier. Aha. Okay. And then according to the map, there's another big split along here. Which, I mean, it labelled it Barlin's Map 1, so I'm assuming Barlin might have an expanded map for this further part. Um, yeah, we'll go down this way first. Hello. So, Middle Shaft Key, Balan's Second Map, and Balan's Journal. Okay. So, this morning we discovered small slits in the tunnel walls. Cracks don't seem to be dangerous, but I ordered additional wooden supports. Uh, Rudolf Ferdinand is spluttering. I think he does not enjoy the temperature at this depth. Uh, one of them hears, claims to hear knocking. Okay. Ah, and this is the map of this region. So we are in this bit. And down here is where the quest marker is leading us. But there was a door there, which I'm assuming is locked. I need to go back down the middle path again. Aha. Right. That should do it. Come out of the way. Away from the explosion. There we go. Okay. So that's one of the things collapsed. So that should stop the rock fiend spawning. And I'm going to guess that this is locked. Oh, no, door unlocked. Oh, is that the middle shaft key thing? Okay. Ooh. It's a bit of an odd room. Um... Oh, we're being attacked on multiple sides now. Right. Right. Why did he turn green? I assume I have a poison effect or something? No idea what that. That's as high as texture. Interesting. Actually, one of the mods has updated that texture and left their mark on it. Um, right. How's the map looking? Sure. Let's. I'll keep with my plan of following the left path. That seems sensible. Because I think this is going to come to a dead end. Aha, and there's more red glowing, which means there's probably an important item here. 
Oh, and there is a way through there. Uh, lower shaft key, third map, and journal part three. Right. Monsters, monsters everywhere. What a surprise. Oh, it's Durin's Bane, apparently. Uh, they delve too deep and awoke a nameless fear. Fly, you fools. <laughs> okay. And then, yeah, that's the map of this little area that we're in currently. Uh, sure, I'll take all of those. Or not. That was a lot over my weight limit. Um, don't need that. Don't need that. Is there an easy drop button? If there is, I don't know what it is. Uh, well, that was a pointless pickup. I think I've just thrown it all away. Right. 